Right, um, good morning ladies and gentlemen, we're going to start our next ferret race, we've got five races lined up for you, so weather permitting, I'm just going to watch the weather, it's ideal at the moment, but when it comes around here at past two, it tell me it shines in here, so this afternoon we'll be watching it. We're racing right up to past two anyway, so uh, and on the on the hour, or hour I mean, so next race we'll, like, we'll be at past twelve. Now. We're going to speed it up, I'm not going to talk for, for, or for like I normally would. So um, have a look at these ferrets because they're all in these colour cages and we've got the same colour tickets and it's just a bit of fun. It's, uh, you can win a pound and you can then lose 50p, but if you lose your 50p then it goes back to the, the ferret rescue which I'm based on Exmoor. <coughs> And surprisingly, how many people come from Exmoor down here today? I spoke to quite a few, and they only, they only live about 10 miles away. So there you are. I'll whiz around, and sooner we can sell the tickets, we'll let them go, and it seems to be fine. We can wrap this all up in five, ten minutes, brilliant. So uh, I'll whiz around. So who's going to start me off? Anybody going to start me off with 50p? What colour do you want? Orange, white, blue, Zero. pink, green, or yellow? Two. What colour? First would be our Podesta with the uh, orange. First, uh, the royal Say orange. Yep. Class 13. One orange. One green. Pure <laughs> that means that the uh, centre ring is now clear for class 7. Class 7 is a performance pony in and the class. And in the age, not exceeding 42, the ponies will be required to perform one or two simple movements in hand. The uh, emphasis on the judging will be on calmness and the size of calmness and obedience. It's what we call a performance pony in class 7. And this will be judged in green number two. Okay. The centre of it. One orange, one green. 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 That's the way, just keep it going. <laughs> Do you know how to get this done? <laughs> yeah. Or to get all the races in then. <laughs> Once it get hot. Team. Rider, <laughs> six years <laughs> and <laughs> I'm looking at the 33, which was Lucy, Lucy Owen with Mr. Squiggle. Second was number 45, M. F. Haddo with Vegas. And third was Mrs. H. Prethero and Miss Monk with Royal Nash. Sorry about the confusion just now. I had to clean the glasses. That was the winners of the under 16s ponies riders. <laughs> Right, I'm looking for uh, looking for six children. Difficult today because obviously they all gone to school. Uh, mm. They normally come running around here about four o'clock. All these local boy kids. And, is there any children I want to start with me start? All they got to do is lift the lever up. Wait, mum, you come in with her then. You have to push that lever up. Is there any youngsters out there can do that? If not, I'm going to ask the grown-ups. Sure, they're English. Afraid not afraid to come in. Right, any grown-ups come in and help me now quickly. We well, need to get these running. I'll do one. Right, come on then. I'll give you a go. Right, we got another one there. Two more. Right, we got them now. We got too many now. Yeah, one on the green. Here you go. One on the green there. One on the green. Okay. 
Right. Shouldn't have no problems now because they're, they're a bit older. We normally have the you know the youngsters a bit of fun for them, really. But we're going to have one practice start. Okay. When I blow this whistle, like that. Not yet. You bad as a children. You you, um, you lift that lever up and put it on the ground. Do you think you can do that one? Um, that one's going to be a bit tight, so we have to get a good grip. Mind you, you don't break your nails, all right? Right, now, if you catch out the front lids now, it's only a practice, catch out those front lids now. That's it. When you hear the whistle, lift it up. You want to press it? Are you ready? Ready? That's it. Put it. The main thing is that when you do lift it up for good, is to put them back on the ground. Don't put them back again, because... Um, when I, I'll put it back, because we had some rain... That's it. Now, they'll come along here. Um, obviously, you've got fresh farts this, this time. They will come along here and they eventually win when their tails is fully out. Okay, so when he pokes his nose up, that's not the one we want or I want. I want the one that's going to come out and clear his tail from these little holes here. Probably run towards you. And, and that's the one I want. Now, I'm going to ask that gentleman there if I can, if you don't mind. Can I ask you to be my judge? Yeah. What's your name? Chris, you don't mind? No. Because um, Chris is going to be my judge. Obviously, I'm on my own today, and we normally have the grandchildren and all that watching. Chris is going to tell me which one's going to win. Chris, you know he wins when his tail is fully out, yes. not when he's poking his nose up. So if there's any photo finish or any dispute, there's Chris, all right? <laughs> I've been doing this now for 39 years, and I've learned now the last five years to pass the buck on to somebody else. <laughs> Because it gets very tight, believe me. But I don't think you'll have trouble with these race because obviously you've got a mixture of older ones and younger ones, all right? So plenty of noise in a minute when they start. Once I can do race all day. This one I stay there talking rap and all, which they wanted me to do. I ain't talking you lot rap and all, and nothing being rude or anything like that, but I'm looking after you for it today. <laughs> right, plenty of noise then. Don't get disappointed if your ferret doesn't come out the box or it goes so far as the cage and turn around and come back. I can't hear nothing about that. Are you ready? Daddy! Judge it, I don't know. I guess you could judge it, but I don't know. 
Well, you get all confused here now. This one here got Danny get early. Who are you coming up now? Got the idea. Well done. Well done. That's it, boy. Come on out, try to put you in the box. Come on. Come on, hurry up. You get got to pay out. There's a little devil to go back. Yes, I got them come right out, I'll say. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> you'll see you in that past one. Oh, no.